Will you live in your home country in the future? Uh, possibly at some point. I haven't got any plans to though. Pretty happy with my life here in Vietnam actually. But then again, if something pops up back home that I need to deal with, I might go back temporarily. Which part of your country would you like to live in? In the UK, oh, I'd, I'd have to say Manchester. It's simply because it's what I know and love about my country, you know? All my friends are there, all my family are there. I couldn't imagine life in a, another city, to be honest. Do you know your country's history? A bit, yeah, from what I learnt in school. Um, I've seen a few documentaries about it too. Uh, I've never really researched it or got too deep into my country's history. So, yeah. What interests you about your country's history? If I had to choose an era, I'd probably say the Industrial Revolution. Uh, I think it was between the 17 and 1800s. And everything about it just really fascinates me. There was lots of ingenious contraptions being made, and uh, it's just the way it happened, really. Are most people proud to be from your country? I'd say so, yeah. Even though we had a bit of an embarrassment over Brexit, uh, I think most people tend to have some sense of national pride. What makes you proud of being from your country? Now that is difficult to say. Um, I can't exactly say it's the food or the cuisine because we tend to use other countries' cuisine back home. Same in home cooking too. Uh, if I have to choose something, I'd probably say the way we speak our language. It's quite poetic at times. How would you improve your home country? Personally, I'd like to revert the tuition fees back to what they were. I think that would just encourage more people to get higher education. Though I understand why the tuition fees were increased, I genuinely believe this would benefit everybody.